Getting into your Exogen suit. Exogen is a base compression wear. And like any compression wear, there's a few little tricks to getting it on right, getting into the proper place. One thing about compression wear, it's a little tight going on, especially that first time, but once you get that, it tends to open up over those first couple of weeks and it becomes quite fitting to you and you go through the process quite quickly. So we're gonna start off with Pete. One of the pieces we'll take a look at putting on is a few tricks with is the top. Now one thing about Exogen is it's a multi-layer because it needs to support the resistance loading for movement. So it's a little more tricky, but uh, quite simple. So putting the top on, you just wanna make sure, first and foremost, that your postural straps, which you can see in a second, are rolled and the Velcro is away attached at the back so the Velcro doesn't bind. Getting it on is pretty straightforward. Put one arm in, put the other arm in, get that piece nice and snug right up at the shoulders. And for you guys like Pete, you've got a good muscular set of shoulders. You wanna make sure it comes over that nice and easy. Switch to the back, snug it down. And as you can see with Pete, it's coming on snug and it should be like that because you don't want this thing moving around. Once it's on, those pastoral supports, you can see here, they're elastic and they're designed to give you support and functional core support while training. They simply strap up wherever you're comfortable. The tighter you pull them, the more support you get. Just like a sort of a soft version of a weightlifting belt, it gives you that core stability and a little bit of function, especially when you're loaded. And most athletes know a little bit of back pain seems to come more often than we like. So it gives a little bit of a benefit feature for you. Next thing we'll look at is the arm sleeves. All the Exogen line is actually designed along your muscle fascial. All these lines that you see aren't style lines, they're fascial lines. And the product is built to allow you to move. There's literally not a construction line on this product across a movement area. Unlike a lot of products out there, we didn't build it for that style. The only style is that little bit of green you see here. And one thing that does is once you do get the product on, it fits and allows movement, like in the upper thoracic and the umbilical region, allowing those rotations and individual panels, once loaded, to move independently. Just like the, your sleeves. Now all the sleeves have a postural, a, a, a fascial line. That fascial line is the spine that goes down the back of the limb, the back of the leg, forearm, upper bicep. So Pete's gonna get on one of the upper arm sleeves, or the full arm sleeve, sorry. So again, you can see that spine, couple of quick tri tricks. First thing you do, make sure all your straps are open. Those straps are there to make it easy. So don't leave them closed and struggle. Straps are open, we'll talk about those in a sec. Take the bicep part, the top part, roll it over the forearm. Makes it easy going on once it's on. And if you notice also for the full arm, that opening is at the elbow and the crease. It's, or, or sorry, the crease, not the elbow, yeah? So it just allows that nice movement in the elbow. Keep that opening right to the front. And then you'll notice Pete will snug that right up, get the wrist to aspect right on the wrist, pull it right up to the elbow. And once it's in at the elbow, the last piece is simply to roll it up over the bicep and strap down. You wanna snug that in. And again, your first time, it's going to have a little bit of movement and struggle getting those lines in the right place. And once you're in there, strap down, close your straps nice and easy without tension. Now you see this strap here, you notice where Pete's got that, he's got that up top the bicep. These straps perform another function. Once you're loaded, you're going to cinch these straps down, tense as you want them, because that thing can hold a kilo to two of load and you don't want that moving. So you want to make sure those straps are nice and tight and they're in the right position, pinching up at the top of that bicep, pinching at the top of that forearm. And when you're not loaded, you simply leave them loose. So that's the full kit on Pete. Now let's go over to Farah who's going to show us uh, the last piece that we want to demonstrate. The shorts are pretty straightforward. You can put them on quite easily. I think you've got that figured out. Uh, so we'll look at the calf sleeve. Again, the calf sleeve has a spine. That spine goes at the back. Simply open up all your straps, makes it easy to go on. Straps always open from outside to in. And remember, all of this is also in your PDF user guide that's in your product and on our website. You notice Farah rolled it down over top. Just a little trick to getting it on. And again, you can see here the spine is at the back, the straps open from outside to in. She's brought it up nice and high at the knee to really capture that. And again, we mentioned this is compression wear, meets all your international standards, 
Don't cinch those up if you're using the compression aspect, just set them loosely and you're ready to go. So a couple of other features before we talk about movement. We mentioned the postural straps, it's a really unique feature that gives you an added functional core support. We mentioned compression and also thermoregulation. This inner layer is a full layer of high performance wicking material to allow that sweat to come to the other layers and breathe. It's cool max protected as well and you'll notice that in all your key sweat zones between the shoulder blades and in the chest and of course in the underarms. The other thing you'll notice right off the bat is these perforations. Those perforations actually remove 20% of the product so you get the best evaporative cooling hair on skin. And those are some of the key features for movement and performance. So guys, what do you think about how it feels? It feels absolutely amazing. One thing I love about this suit is that it fits really, really well. I know as a woman, like you want your clothes to fit because you want to be able to move in them. Because as me as a gymnast, I need to move because I don't just stay stagnant. I'm not that weight. We need to actually move. So I need to be able to pipe. I need to be able to arch. And most importantly, I need to be able to stretch. <laughs> That's really, really good. Yeah. And so now a gymnast moves in the extreme ranges of motion and especially as a woman it's really important that we have spent time trying to get these, uh, these little aspects working well because when you're concentrating on your sport, recreational or professional or elite like these guys, you want to be able to focus. Pete, how about as a martial artist? I mean, you're in some pretty extreme positions on the ground, kicking, standing. How does it feel? Um, well, it's very good. The compression is very solid. Uh, yep. I use a lot of uh, power in my calves. Yep. So having my compression around the calves is a very, a very good feeling. Cool. There's also a lot of shock that goes into our, our style of fighting. So yep. uh, we need to have that absorbed and compression also helps there. Yep. And uh, what's great is there's a lot of flexibility, uh, even whilst weighted. So yep. um, I can train with all of my full movements with loaded weights. Do you, now, do you feel restricted? I mean, the movement, your legs, your hips, anything? It's all very good, very easy to move around. No, no different to normal. Yeah. But uh, just slightly more compressed and everything feels a little bit tighter, which is good. Yeah, and, and to be honest, what we tried to design this was, although it's a new form of resistance training, we wanted it to be a solid garment, something you can wear, you can load, you can unload, but it wasn't interfering with anything like the older versions of some of the more heavy garments that people have used. I think the best thing about this is that it's breathable. Like, you don't want to feel like you're in something that's heavy, the one that you can't breathe in, the one yeah. that, like, when you're moving and you're just like, there's something that, no, this doesn't do it. It's like, especially in can put weights on it, and that's what I love. Because, like, for gymnastics, like, you can and have like really heavy weights and to have it on and to have be, being able to move is just an amazing thing. So we're talking about the weights, that's the next key exciting feature about Exigen, our groundbreaking technology. Let's get these guys loaded up and we'll see what they can do.